Hey everyone, welcome to this channel. My name is AK. I'm a Eurovision fan from Germany. And this year I decided to document my first reaction to all the entries for the 2024 Eurovision Song Contest. I'm not a musician, not a singer, I'm just somebody who really likes the contest. And in honor of today's country, I decided to wear my little orange shirt because we are reacting to the Netherlands today. The artist for the Netherlands is Joost Klein and his song is Europapa. And Joost Klein is kind of famous here in, in Germany. He had a very big hit last year. I actually started to follow him on Instagram and he's doing the social media game very well. He already gets a bonus point from me because he's a fellow YouTuber. He started on YouTube and I mean yay for creative ideas on YouTube. So that's why I'm actually very excited for this one because I think that he's not just only a singer or a whatever he is, he is more like an artist. I'm actually expecting something very special and I'm excited for this one. <gasps> okay, let's go. Europapa, the Netherlands, Joost Klein. <laughs> let's go. Welkom in Europa, blijf hier tot ik dood ga. Europa, pa, Europa, pa. Welkom in Europa, blijf hier tot ik dood ga. Yes, oh my god. Europa, pa. Bezoek mijn friends en friends of neem de been naar Wayne. Ik wil weg uit de Netherlands, maar mijn paspoort is verdwenen. Heb gelukkig geen visum nodig om bij je te zijn. Dus neem de bus naar Polen of de trein naar Berlijn. Ik heb geen geld voor Parijs. Look at it. Mijn fantasie heb je een eurotje, please. Zeg merci en alsjeblieft. Behalve de tijd, dus ik ben elke dag op reis, want de wereld is van mij. Welkom in Europa, blijf hier tot ik dood ga. Europa, pa, Europa, pa. Welkom in Europa, oh my blijf hier tot ik dood ga. Europa, pa, Europa, pa. This is fun. He was talking about Germany earlier. Techno rave stuff. Synthesizer. Oh, I love the video. It's not full HD. It's like the old school. 4x3. Nice. Retro. Welcome in Europa, Junge. Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> the Dutch Berghain. Bring the Berghain to the Eurovision stage. Oh. Aan het einde van de dag zijn we allemaal mensen. Mijn vader zei me ooit: het is een wereld zonder grenzen. Ik mis je elke dag, is wat ik stiekempjes fluister. Zie je nou wel, pa? Ik heb naar je geluisterd. The windmill. From me to my pal. Oh my god. Jules Klein. Oh my god, I really like that. Is this the new Eurovision hymn? Okay, I really need to look up the lyrics for this. I kind of understood a little bit because German and Dutch are, have some similarities. Overall, it was something about Europe and everybody is united in Europe. I have to I have to look up the, the connection. I love the style. I mean, those 90s techno synthesizer beats. Is, it, this is so 2020. This is a 2024 song. Seriously. And maybe it's something controversial. Netherlands over Croatia. Ooh. 
Personal taste, personal taste. It has kind of the same structure of the song in the middle, like the dance break, the hard song, the hard stuff, and something soft on the edges. Okay, Joost, if you see this, das war richtig geil. Richtig geil. Wirklich. I can totally see this as a fan favorite. I would give 10 points to this plus one extra point because he's a YouTuber. In Eurovision measurements, this is, is this 12 points to the Netherlands? So if you like that kind of music, I recommend you to watch this year's entry for Finland. I will put it here. And if you want something completely different and you say, oh, no, I want the soft parts and the more pop part, Go over and watch the reaction I did to Poland because it's it's very different. <laughs> Thanks for watching the video and I will see you for the next reaction. Tschüss!